know this man? Have you seen this man? Free Andrew Tate! He a real one! I'm a big feminist. Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate! We're live before Florida. We're with? I don't know. What's your name? Your name? Oh, we're Serena. With? Bro, we're with? Hi. I don't f***ing know. <laughs> Serena, I don't know my where are you from, Serena? I'm from Chicago. I was hoping she's like, I don't know where the f*** I'm at from. Where the fuck are I'm from? Serena and... Leah. She's getting married. This is the we're out here on the streets, okay. yeah. trying to find out thoughts, women's the hood, thoughts, yeah. the yeah. hood. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what do you think about Andrew Tate? So start, start with you. Start with you. Yeah, I don't know enough to give a statement on this man. I agree. But popular opinion from the women, based on what I've heard, is you don't love Andrew it. Tate. You think yeah. should be back in prison? Well, I don't know about that. Oh, MTRM! We're live! Let's go! We're live out here for Florida! This is B.O.B. Big booty! Let's go! Our Andrew Tate is free! What are your thoughts? Free Andrew Tate! He a real one! He a real one! So guys, guys, three hours ago, he was free. Man is free, walking the streets. What are your thoughts? Go! First, wait, wait, first of all, where, what's your name? Where are you from? Austin Burst, I'm from Broward County. Steven Alfonseca. Oh, oh, shit. I'm from Broward County too. I'm Freddy, I'm from Miami. Antonio Piedra, I'm from Opalaca. Opalaca. Nigga, I'm What did he say? Hey. Oh. I'm from Broward County. Oh, I'm, I'm Alex Udell from Broward County. Broward baby. County. Hey. Woo! Hey. Nice. Andrew Tate out. Let's go. Tate, what are your thoughts? He's free. Man's walking four hours, three, four hours ago. He's on the street. <laughs> Finally, he's fucking free. He ain't do nothing. He inspires men nowadays to do shit good. Yes, I'm sir. Telling, people hate on him for him speaking hey, fast. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's what I was gonna say. How did he make you better? How did he make you better? He inspired me to change as a person. It's like not all women are just used for fucking, I, you know, pussy. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I think, yeah. I think free and Andrew Tate, free and Andrew Tate could have been the best thing for this country, bro. Dang. He's a high. He's and a, if he comes the here, world. the fucking world. No, so I'm saying internationally, no. that is the best thing that could have happened. He though. shows you how to be a high valuable man. High valuable man. man. If you're not high valuable man in 2023. Honestly, get the kick fuck rocks. Out of here. Kick rocks. We're fucking live, Fort Lauderdale, with two beautiful uh, snow bunnies, blondies, beautiful girls. <laughs> what are your names? Cammy. Cammy. Melody. Talking to town, Andrew Tate's out. He was released. Judge was like, overruled. Man is free. And she was a woman judge, by the way. Just to throw that out. I think he's very sexist and doesn't respect women, so I don't like him. She's saying, f this guy. That's what she's saying. Fuck Andrew Tate. Fuck Andrew Tate. Double, double fuck him. Double fuck him. Fuck him. Right. Yeah, right. yeah we Listen, don't like him. If he was a bug, what would you do to him? I would snap on it. He's a bug. I would snap on it. But would you do the, would you do the fuck like the... Yeah, oh, he's spin that like, shit around. Aye, damn, she not playing. He says that women have their role, men have their role. Um, that if society broke down, um, women would revert back to their roles. Meaning, we're all about fem- Correct, so we're all about feminism because our country's very powerful. But when shit hits the fan, who's, you know, taking the roles? Men are gonna be the firefighters, putting the fires out. Men are gonna be the ones that are arresting the, everyone raiding, you know, houses and homes. That's his thoughts. Women are like, this guy. Some, a lot of okay, women are, you know, so ego. my opinion on that is like, if he wanted to be my husband and pay all my bills and take care of me and all that good stuff, then yeah, I would not have no problem being a stay at home mom, cooking, cleaning, doing laundry, all that good stuff. But if he wants me to work and do all that on top of that, I would say fuck no. I've never once gone to the cops and pretended to fucking fake a lie that I was kidnapped. Like, nah, bro, you stayed in the relationship. You were manipulated, yes. You were coerced in that that situation, yes. But, like, you were not held captive. Like, you were not chained to a fucking pole. You were not kidnapped. Like, you stayed in that relationship, and now you feel stupid as fuck because you stayed in that relationship. Out here with? Pearl. Talia. Talia, where are you from, Talia? I am from here. But uh, ethnicity-wise? Ethnicity, I'm Russian and Italian. Russian, I, I hear the Russian. But if yet. But if yet. And I'm Russian. Oh, okay. Oh, you both Russian. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. Um, how do y'all know each other? Tell the story. Tell the story. <laughs> oh, there's a good story here. I know there's a fucking good story. So one time she just showed up at my house, and then we just became friends. Yeah. Damn, like just... She ran away and then... Oh, shit. Oh, that's really cool. No, that ass, I was going to make a joke, but that's actually really cool. Okay, cool. Now, let me ask you. Andrew Tate, you know about him? Um, what are your thoughts? 
about him. So just as a person, before I like I ask you the next one. Fuck Andrew Tate. Fuck this guy. Mm-hmm. Why? Because it's Andrew Tate. Tell the kids. Tell your wife. He audience. has no rights. There is no rights. Just because it's an individual. Yes, exactly. Now let me ask you. What are your thoughts? What are Andrew Tate? Before I do a follow-up on that one. To be honest, I really don't give a fuck. Good. I mean, good. At least that's a whole, like, the prison system is a whole nother conversation. Ooh, okay. Like, that, I can't. Facts. Right, can't. facts. But that, not even American prism. That, we're talking about uh, Romanian. I mean, um, Romanian. Yeah, Romanian that's a whole different. Romanian prism. Oh, my God. We're talking about a whole different thing. Prism no, across the country. Man was there for three months. He's like, I haven't bathed. I haven't, like, I was like, they didn't feed me. I don't think that the prison system is humane okay. at all. Right. Like, period, anywhere. Right, the U.S. So. is bad, but overseas, it's way worse. How do you it's... <laughs> Cause I'm cultural, well, that's how. You're from where? Yeah. Chicago. Yeah. No, but I'm saying ethnicity, I know that. But I'm, saying... Italian. I'm Italian. Italian. Yeah, I'm from, um, I'm in Boca. So you're I'm about, like, Boca. 35, 45 minutes. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good drive. Shit, that's a, that commitment to get yeah. down here. Okay, you're here visiting friends? Or... Yeah, me and my girlies are hanging out. They're... Busy. Where the fuck is Sully girlfriend? They're busy. Oh, busy. busy. <laughs> Damn. We all been there. I've lost yeah. friends. She's lost friends. We fucking, they all disappear. Anyway, it it's all right. Happens. But anyway, Andrew Tate, I don't know. I filled you in a little bit on right. his story, but what are you, your thoughts is whatever. What are your thoughts on him? From stuff that I've heard your other than you. Other than mine. Here go. He seems so. pretty much oh, oh. a dickhead. He's a dickhead. <laughs> dickhead. Okay. Dickhead. dickhead. I don't like the fact. I'm a big feminist. I'm a very big feminist. I believe any any woman can do anything, anywhere, like Facts. literally anything. Facts. Women can run the world. I right. believe that. Women can also not do stuff. You know what I mean? That men are more right. dominant. In. But keeping somebody captive, like holding that against them, absolutely not. That's my girl. And that should happen. And that should happen here and there. Oh, for, she just walked away. She's like, I don't even know. She's getting fixed. Oh, okay. That's, that's, oh, that's right. She's like, fuck this. Fuck, I'm hungry. Anyway, but so yeah. no, I, I'm with you. Like, if you're being cat, like, and that shit happens. You hear yeah. left and right in poor, third world countries. Right. I mean, I'm, I'm from a, I'm from South America. Like, that shit happens left and right. right. So it's unfortunate. But you're right. Women can run the world. Right. You know, song like Beyonce. She <laughs> runs the world. <laughs> anyway, but. But anyway, um, pleasure talking to you. Yes. And I hope you have a good night. <laughs> anyway, so no, he's just got out of jail today. Like literally four hour, a few hours ago. What are your thoughts? Go back to jail. Judge, I believe, I could be wrong, female. Let him out because she's like, there's not enough incriminating proof. What are your thoughts? Go back to jail. Well, I'm, that's what I'm going to say. Back to jail. Back to jail. Send him off back. Say again? Back. Back to jail. Back. Uh, freedom. yeah, we're freedom. freedom. Yeah, freedom. No input. No, what do you mean no fucking input? No input. No, 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 this ain't, this ain't a maybe, this is yes or no. He should be a free man, all right? That's uh, all I got to This say. ain't Burger King, you can't have it your way. Free man. Free man. Free man. Free man. Free, 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 thank you. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. He literally has pushed a lot of men to be there by themselves, but he was locked up four months ago and put in, he was, for no reason, uh, Romanian uh, authorities took him, arrested him, and they basically said on kidnapping charges from an American. Kidnapping woman. Basically, hold on, let me fill you in. So basically, the his ex-girlfriend accused them from the States, calls the embassy and says, he had me captive. They arrest him, he doesn't know what's going on. Four months ago, he's in prison for four months. The judge investigates, the district investigates, they find out that the girlfriend had sent emails to the friend as soon as they arrested him was like bitch i'm gonna be famous i got him arrested i got him arrested i got him arrested right he's let go like three hours ago he was finally let go three hours he's for a free man he's talking to town now my thoughts or our, your thoughts do you think he should have been let free or he should be like fuck him well again his if the if the ex-girlfriend said we got him bitch do you think he was really? She was really. He really kidnapped her. A lot. Some women say, yeah, that she was just trying to, you know, push her agenda. Other women, like you, say. Okay, so that's kind of a hard decision because I've kind of been in like a little predicament like that. Like, 
you're just so stuck in love like you just want to stay to like make him feel good about himself because he is doing everything for you and you feel like you can't leave but then once you do get the chance to be set free and like you're like fuck it i got him whatever he's gone i don't have to worry about him so now I no no like verbatim I'm like i'm gonna be famous but like to the friend i'm gonna be famous bitch we got him kind of thing like i'm gonna be famous bitch though okay you thought you had him in jail so you're like okay i'm set free now i'm famous and now it's like the the um, verse has unrolled. Right, right. I feel like. She, but do you think? Do you think? Then that's why the judge let go of the case because she gloated. She was like, "Why'd you gloat?" And she was like, "I didn't have a response." She didn't have a response. The judge, the lawyer was right. like, "Well, she, she was happy. She was unrolled." I do, I do personally think she may have been doing it on purpose because, like I said, I've been in a situation myself, and it's like you just want to make the man feel good. But once he's taken away, would you gloat? Would you? Did you gloat, or did you gloat when he was taken away? When he's finally left okay, your life? Like I'm fucking free. Did you say fuck him? Like yeah, like fuck him. I'm I'm free, I can do whatever. Now, if he was locked up, let's put an imaginary scenario. You're still with him, he gets locked up because of your doing. Would you glow and be like, the hypothetical, and you would you go to the friend and be like, we got him, bitch? Not if it was my doing, you, would no. You? If it was my doing, absolutely Would you not. contact your glow or at all? No, no, I wouldn't glow, but I'd be like, damn, bitch, like, I, I I'm free. Yeah, like, I finally did what I needed to do. Not we got him. To be, yeah. Because if he's doing, it, only if he's doing wrong, though, if he's, like, beating her and all that abusive shit, yeah, bitch, we fucking got him. Finally, I'm free, you know what I'm saying? But if it was, like, the other way and she was just tired of the shit and she was just like, bitch, I'm free and we're going to be famous, then it's wrong. Now, let me ask you a final question. Now, in that situation, if, because it comes from third world countries that some women are taken out of the gutters, given a better life, given better, you know, law, you know, clothes, jewelry, whatever, from a rich man. Is it okay that they can have them in a form of, I don't want to say manipulation, but a form of, no, uh, that's never okay. not manipulation, manipulation is a strong word, a form of, uh, of, of gender, gender, uh, gender boundaries. I'm the man, you listen to what I say, but I took you out of the gutter. I saved you. You would have never, you would never live this life. Do you think Let's it was, it's okay? Your, your, your thoughts. Let's go! Um, fuck no. Be his motherfucking ass and put his I'm ass in motherfucking in <laughs> That's it. Fuck, what was it? Say that last one. Fucking right in the fucking right in the pussy. Thank you, girls. Oh, shit. Not good. Go, hey, good job. Thank you. That was good. That hey, was really good. You. That, that was, was great. Really that, that, you that love me. You're the first one actually that says you would pay, play your role. Basically, you played your role. You say, so if he says, if I'm happy, if I'm happy. So if the man, if the man says, so if the man says, I got you with, you don't have to worry about bills. You don't have to worry about food. I bring, I bring the food. All you have to do is, you know, be, a, be faithful. Be no, as men, like he, what his mentality is, be faithful, be faithful, and have my side at all times. Like back me up, even if I'm wrong. If he. If he's showing me the love and the support that I feel like that I need, like if he's like loving me, if like happy marriage, happy life, happy wife, you know what I'm saying? So yes, I would, I would, me personally, yes. But if he was like, you have to work and do all that and do all this, fuck so, no. But um, how do you feel about his whole situation where he's like, you know, he does empower some men, and some men have gotten, actually, like, are thanking him because, you know, you know, he's, like, pushed them to be better men, get more money, more whatever, whatever, resources in life. It's a scheme. It's scheme. Not a scheme, a scheme. It's a scheme. scheme. <laughs> Got you. Facts. Facts. It's a scheme. What yeah, about the women fucking. that he takes and, like, gives them a good life? Like, they're, whatever. I don't think he does lies. He doesn't do that. It's a lie. Lies. It's a lie. Bro, it's the Matrix. Yeah, for real. No. For him. Anyway, thank you, girls. Appreciate you. Kick rock. Yo, how do you change this man's life? How do you change your life? Okay. Your life. He your changed. Life. He changed my life like detrimentally. How? Detrimentally. So the, first, I was a low value man. A low, low, value, low, low value man. Terminology. He's laying it. So I started. I started. I started. I started listening to him, and I took. And I started. And I started listening to his knowledge, and I was like, wow. I was like, wow. He's right. Let me become a high value man. Yes, so what did I do? Yes, I became a high value man. Free Andrew Tate, be on the streets. Let's what he go. did, pretty much what he did was start respecting himself. He respected himself from that day on. And, and free, free Andrew Tate, free Trisha Tate. Don't forget about the brother. Come oh, on the now. brother. No, the brother. brother. He's a good guy. And and keep Sneeko free. I don't want to see Sneeko locked up. Fuck Sneeko. I want to see him all free. Keep Sneeko free. Hey, they're all good.
They're good all in, they're, they're all good influences to men. They teach us how to be high value men, how to keep these bitches from fucking us over. They're the best. Keep them free. Keep them free. Hey, yeah, yeah. Yo, why do they call them thotties? Why do they call them thotties? Cause they thought. Yeah. Oh! Damn! Damn! My man, my man. Sign off. All right. Sign off. Guys, signing off. Thank you. Thank you, boys. Thank you. Hey, you, like, you like that, right? Where's the Yo, you don't give a fuck about it. Okay. Now, I'll ask you, Andrew Tate, he puts a lot of men up. They feel better around, you know, hearing his hearing his hearing his uh, you know, his advice. What are your thoughts on the women where he some women are like, you know what? I do believe there's gender roles. I believe that women should be some women, not you. The women we've had an interview saying I, if he buys me Gucci bags, Prada bags, I'm, I don't want to say the term, but well, they live, they're okay with it. Do you think that's okay way to live or teach their own? It's an okay way to live. It's everyone like does them, you know. Not your way to live. Yeah, it's not my way, you know. It's like literally. standards. Yeah, exactly. What are you, you have high standards. Yeah. So you, you could fend for yourself. So if I came here with me like. We're gonna sleep tonight. Let's go. I got you with a Prada bag, a Lamborghini. What are your right Lamborghini? Pull up. What are your What are your thoughts? If I pull up and say we're sleeping tonight. I mean that doesn't really impress me. It wouldn't impress. Me. Back. Yo, we got listen right here. Cha Ching. We have a girl that is a winner. That's what we're looking at. As a man, no, I'm serious. As a man, and not just me. A lot of men, we appreciate quality women. And what are your thoughts? I, and it's okay if I bring you a diamond right here, a fucking Louis, and you're like, no, that's okay to live. A lot of women are okay with that. Your thoughts, or, or you're like, fuck that kind of way of life. I mean, I really don't care about materialism shit. Like, I don't care. Okay. Okay. So he pulls up and says, I'm taking you out to uh, Paris, but you're going to do what I tell you. Hell no. Facts. Yo, two girls out here. How old are you guys? I'm, I'm curious. 18. 18. 18. 18. And, and smart. And smart. Now, the news of the talk of the town is Andrew Tate just got free. Literally, three hours ago. He's a free man. Yeah, four, four or five months he was in prison. No reason why. They just arrested him in his home. What are, what, are your, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts now that he's a free man? Do you think he should go back to prison or do you think, hey, oh, I don't care. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck, but I think he should just mind his own business, you know, like stop. Keep his mouth shut better. Yeah, mouth like nobody needs his opinion. When you could have left, and now you're gone, and now she feels stupid, and now she doesn't want to like. When you're in it, you're blind. You're blind. No, when you're in it, you're, you're blind. blind. You're, blind. You're, blind. Yeah. you're so blind. Now, yeah, you're question. blinded you by said, love, but like. You said, hold on. So you said a great word, coerced. Now, in a woman that's been through that. Yeah. What can you, like, again, this is a man that hasn't experienced that, that kind of situation. What do you mean by coerced? Like, what can a woman be coerced with? Like, give me, how can a man manipulate you? And you said you've lived somewhat through that. Yeah, what, yeah. what was it? Money, um, parents was like, I have this on you. What, what was it? Great question. Um, for example, uh, my ex, um, I never liked posting my shit on social media. Like, I was not one to like post my boyfriend you know on social media but he was so manipulative to the point that he made me like post him on social media he made me do all this shit and like I never wanted to do it but the way he talks and the way he like manipulated me it coerced me into this situation and, and he forced me basically to like so he blackmailed me basically in a way in a way and he was basically like um, if you don't post on social media about black me man, then you don't man. love me black like, that's black. And I'm like, that's not that's true. Black, like, that's blackmail people. Black yeah. Men. So like, I don't. I I just I I feel for her. I honestly feel for her because like I've been in that situation and it fucking sucks. Like, you feel like a fucking idiot, but at the same time, like, he he's fucked up. She's fucked up. Go get some help, bro. Toxic. It's, oh, toxic, oh, as it's toxic as hell. It's, it's so you're, what hell. you're saying is basically, and which makes sense, it's not one-sided, it's two people that are toxic. That super toxic. Or men, or men. It's super toxic. Like, I mean, she obviously went through that situation and now she needs help and she did the worst of it by going to the cops when she should have just gone to the fucking therapist and seek, seeking help for that, like what I did. But like, 
she went the opposite and she took it to extremes because she felt so much anger and so much pain from that man. She she felt it from him. Which again, like when you're in those situations you're like brainwashed and you're manipulated and so like she took it as like I fucking hate this guy, I'm gonna do the worst to him. So this is what I'm gonna do. But like at the same time you didn't need to do that. Like go heal girl, like you don't need to do that shit. Go heal. Let him let him deal with his own shit. Right, like right, karma's right. a bitch. He if if he's actually the shitty ass person that he is, then it'll come back to him. Right, so an example, right? Which I'm guessing a lot of women I'm, I'm from South America, we, we see that a lot of women are from very poor countries, don't have anything to their name. What if it's a trade-off relationship? Your thoughts. Where, you know, they, they're pulled out of the gutter to live an extravagant life. You want a Birkin, Birkin. You want the hair done, hair, nails, whatever. Right? Is that a form of manipulation? Is that a form of being a coerced? But at the same time, they're given what the average girl gets. Would you say, would, after she left that situation, would you be like, well, turn your mind and be like, well, no, that, that's not fair. I should. Or would you say, no, at the end of the day, you know, the definition wise, that is what it is. You know, that that's a really good question. Cause hey, like, I'm full. I've, I've also been in that situation right. where I dated um, an illegal immigrant from Italy and he manipulated me to the point where I was gonna get married to him for a green card. Right, oh damn. So Jesus. like so I close to getting it. Damn. Yeah. So I fully believe that like love is toxic and you can be blinded by love if that person is mentally unstable and if they are like a narcissist or a sociopath, which are people that I've dated, right. they can fully brainwash you to the point where you feel like you're so in love with them that you'll do anything for them. But in my situation, I was able to break free from that. How? Oh, if you mind me asking this, because I'm curious, like, I had to, move, women, I had to move to a different country. But, like, what, I had what to pushed break. you? Your mom? Like, who, who took you out of that mindset? Because that's a rolling of yeah. toxic ball. If you mind me? Yeah, you no, be, like, uh, my mom was a therapist, to so be your honest. Mom. It was your mom. So, All my right. mom, I mean, I moved to a different country, and I, you know, talked to my mom a lot, and I educated myself on a lot of things, like why I was feeling a certain way, and why I was feeling the things that I felt, and I educated myself on that, and I got to the point where I was like, damn, you know, like, this is a situation that I was in, and this is how I'm gonna better myself after it. Like, at the end of the day, like, we're not perfect. We're not perfect human beings. Man or woman. Everybody has, men or women, we all have our fucking faults, you know, but like, um, it's all what you make from the situation. And like, I made myself a better person from it and that's all that you can do, you know. You you go through all that hard shit and you don't realize it at the time, but like, it makes you a better person and, and that's it. You can either make it better or you can make it worse. And I chose to make it better, so like, I feel for those people who try to make it worse. I wish that they had like a better person to talk to, but there's, there's other ways to go about it. Like I, you know, like well, the situation you. sucks, but I don't think she should have done that at all. But you're one of the lucky few that were able to get out of it, because there are a lot of women that don't. Oh, I know personally, like a few that are, you they know, have it, no idea. It's, it's what we call in Spanish um, um, habit. It's yeah. Habit. Habit. You know, it's just the habit of waking up to yeah. the habit of. That's why I'm very open with my situation because I'm like, I don't want anyone to ever feel like that. And if they do feel like that, I want them to know that like, hey, you don't have to feel that way. If you're feeling a certain way, if you're feeling undermined or belittled, or if you're feeling stuck in a relationship, you don't have to stay in it. Yeah, you don't have to stay in it. Like there's better people out there, and but you, you don't have to make them feel bad, you don't have to make them feel worse, you just have to go find help for yourself, and you have to just focus on yourself and make yourself a better person. Well, honestly, it was a pleasure listening. I actually have all the conversations. Thank you for sharing your story, I'm serious. It was beautiful, and, and, and hopefully it helps out and some women out there that are watching this and they're like, hey, I gotta get out of some nice new socks. Yeah, situation. honestly, girl, get, get, out. Out, get out of the get situation. Out. You deserve better. If you are feeling confused at all about his situations, get the fuck out.